Welcome back to Portal 2. I'm Jimmy Joe. Still haven't gotten the uh, the orange portal yet. Oh, but... brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, yes, the... I did. Do you know what? It just goes to show people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, <laughs> aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. Can't get through there. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here. So Are you? get ready to catch me, all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. Yeah, I'm not going to catch you. On three. Ready? One. Two. Three. That's high. It's it's too high, isn't it, really, that? All right, going on three just gives you too much yep. time to think about it. Yep. Let's no. uh, go on one this time. Just, okay, just, ready? Just let go. Oh, catch me, catch me! Ow! Ow. <laughs> I... I'm not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Um, there you go. Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? I can't, I can't do it if you're watching. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, you can turn around now. <laughs> Secret panel. Right open. While your back was turned. And off we go. Secret panel. Where's the secret panel? Oh, right there. Look at this. No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just... Hold on, then. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, Just <sighs> follow the rail, actually. Oh, no. Yes, hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact, whatever you do. No, thanks, we're good. <laughs> Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. The turrets are so cute in this one. They were cute in the last one too, but um, in this one they're they're mostly malfunctioned. Um, and they... I'm to bring you up <laughs> on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber. And she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. If you want to just call it quits, we could just sit here forever. Well, That's we killed her last option time. Option A, sit here, do nothing. Option B, go through there. And if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. Her. She's off. All fine. On we go. <laughs> there she is. What a nasty piece of work she was. Honestly, like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? Yeah, I'm me. I believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently, this human escaped. And, Look, uh, an incinerator. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where. Um, where was the button over absolutely here? Absolutely nothing happened. And then oh, I can't get to the there, button. So, um, it's over there. Pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch it. All right. Well. Here okay, we go. Down these stairs. Jump. This, actually, look at it. That is quite. A, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Ah! Oh, still held. Still being held. You did, that's a great job. You've applied the grip. We're all fine. That's <laughs> tremendous. <laughs> ah! I just. Sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I've just done it again. Oh, I can't actually let go. I was trying to knock him off the end. Ah! Oh, I can't let him go. This Sad. is the main breaker room. Let's go in. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't even, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as well, soon as you look at something and it doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. Can you see it anywhere? I can't no, see it No, nothing uh, says escape pod. What, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. Let there be light. That's, uh, God. Just quoting God. It's quoting oh, God. Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now. Escape pod, escape pod. This is moving up. Okay. And it's no, don't, don't it worry, flips all the breakers. Oh, this should slow it down. No, makes it go faster. Uh-oh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I, can, I can still stop this. Um, <laughs> uh, Oh, there's a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack it. It's not a problem. A, 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 um, yes. 
Why can't I get out? I can't get out. Wait, did I do big stuff? Do you have a pen? Start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't. Okay, 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 listen. All right, new plan. Nothing more. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, <laughs> after you murdered me. You did what? Uh... Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no! Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. <laughs> but I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. <sighs> it's bright. The Lados is back. Incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when we <laughs> threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old times. Just like old times. Aww. See? They're so scared. They don't want to go into the incinerator. There it is. Hold on. There. Good. You have a dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick oh, save right feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. <laughs> I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. <laughs> Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm That's happy good. to put this all behind us and get back to work. After I'm glad all, that you don't we've uh, got a lot to do, and believe in revenge. More years to do it, more or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me, but the important thing is you are back with me, and now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. <laughs> so you can test again. Chapter 2. We finished the first Sorry chapter. About the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. <laughs> I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. All right. Yep. Okay, well... Oh, I thought this was... Never mind, it's just wet. Alright. There Not we go. Bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. Well, I'm glad you're worried about my well-being, GLaDOS.
This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Laser there. Obviously, these hurt. Just so you will know. Just in case you didn't realize. And we'll do this. Well done. Perfect. Here come the test results. You, you are, are a horrible, horrible person. person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. <laughs> Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Oh. Okay. Oh, what's this? Suckers, ex exit. Oh, it says. I'm sorry. I think it says exit. Oh, exile. Suckers, luck. Too many variables. <laughs> Too many variables. All right. So, where's the cube? The cube's up there. And there is what one one there. So this one needs to go here, and then this one needs to go here. Congratulations. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. <laughs> Glad I was called as fat again. One moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Which isn't anything because I've been kept in suspended animation forever. Um, okay, so button, cube, what do I do with the cube? Go back through here. Okay, so the button's over there. Um, Where's the receptacle? Where is... Oh, it's right there. Okay. Um... Out of the way. Alright. Okay, so this, and then over here, uh, blue, no, orange, there we go, no, come back, oh well, it'll come back, I love how the lasers going into the little receptacle things make it make a like a um, a song I'll give you credit I guess you are listening to me but for the record you don't have to go that
This is how we load trucks. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Whee! Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. <laughs> they could not. Good luck. Eh. Okay. Nope, missed it. Alright. Yeah, got it. Alright, cool. Buttons over there. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too extensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. <laughs> so you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. That would be awful. Absolutely awful. Let's see what the next test is. Because what if you fart? Advanced aerial faith plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass. By <laughs> myself. <laughs> 15 acres of broken glass. Alright, so... Yeah, okay. Ah, crap. I didn't do it in time. Alright. Uh... Okay, so I need orange when I land. There we go. Zoop. Alright, and then... Here comes the junk. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Alright, let's see how many I can catch. Oh, you no. don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Press the button again. Dang it. I couldn't catch any of the balls. Got it. So you don't want to go over there because there's no actual way to get away from it, so you just want to drop it. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was, I was actually, actually talking, talking about, about you. you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> it's okay. GLaDOS gets what's coming to her again. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. All right. Where is the receptacle for this one? There has to be an up somewhere. Is that it? No. Oh, it's got a receptacle oh, on it. Did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? Oh. I'm sorry. I didn't realize that at one. first. I didn't realize that at first. It's companion cube. Oh, no. I fizzled oh. that one too. Oh. oh well. 
We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Aww. Poor companion cube. Hey, it's Wheatley. Uh, right. Get out of there. Okay. We got it down. We got an up. Uh, cube button. I need to go up to this one first. Nope, I can't get up that one first. Okay. I have to go up to this one first. And... Hmm, I need the cube too. Darn it. Okay. Ah. Yeah! Button. Platform. All right, we're good. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Well, clearly we have to. We should be able to grab companion cube from here. Come on. Come on. Oh. Oh. Okay. So if we put it just up like this. Should be able to get it from this corner. Yay! She's gonna fizzle it anyway. I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. Aww. We just have a lot of them. <laughs> She's so mean. She's so mean. Whoa. All right, well, that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you for watching. Um, come back next time for more Portal. And we will, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.